Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Cappies. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Capricorn. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of your fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful, sexy temple of yours, goats, as it take care of you, my loves. Welcome back. Come on in. Have a seat. We're going to see what messages source your guardian angels and your ancestors have for, for you today. Shout out to the Evolving Spirit. Shout out to the Patreon Soul Family as well. Thank you so much, as always, for your continuous love and support. Your love never goes unnoticed on this platform. Thank you so much for being here and allowing me to assist you all, Soul Family, along your spiritual journeys as well. And welcome, Capricorns, to the ones that are new here. Thank you for your comments and your feedback down below. I appreciate you and I thank you. All right, this week we have been focusing in on the color green. Yes, we've been focusing in this week on our heart chakra, opening up our heart space, centering and grounding ourselves, and of course, eating plenty of green fruit and vegetables, right? So thank you all so much. Keep up with the community board. That is where I do post the new colors that we transition each week here and also adjust your notification bell capricorns for when i go live on this platform yes i do go live throughout the week for all zodiac sign readings if you would love to stop by and get a check-in before you get your day started so before we get started we're going to first start out with rolling the dice all right let's see what zodiac signs that you may be encountering with or exchanging energies here with this week or closing out for this weekend and then we're going to dive into tarot land and finish up with my raw tarot index cards all right so let's see what we have here for you wow capricorn all right some of you are this person may be a capricorn like yourself all right let's see who else here we have wow we have aries energy here some of you are this person here may be an aries all right that you may be exchanging energies here with and lastly, we have a Cancerian, all right? A Cancer could be very significant here as well, all right? So, wow, let's now dive into your tarot. Wow, we have the Eight of Cups here, Water Elements here, Cancer, Pisces. This card is particularly Scorpio's energy here. And this card indicates here that someone is deciding to walk away from a situation or a circumstance or Capricorns that they feel like no longer resonates or fulfills their spirit here on an emotional level. Rather, if this is your person here or you Capricorns, someone is definitely deciding to walk away from a situation that they feel like that no longer resonates for them or is for their highest good here. Okay, some of y'all, this could be your person walking away from an ex or a situation from their past and coming towards you. Others of you all, this person could be walking away or deciding to walk away from this relationship or connection here with you. And again, others of you all, this could be you wanting to remove yourself from a situation that you feel like is no more or no longer fulfilling you on a emotional level here. All right, some of y'all feel like this person is no longer emotionally available for you, or you may feel this way about this person. Let's see what else here, goats. Wow, the world cards here. Yeah, this is a cycle here that has closed out, or a chapter here that has finally closed out for this situation for whomever is deciding to walk away and move forward here. There has been a karmic cycle here for a lesson to have been experienced and learned. And now that that has been experienced and learned, this situation has been able to move forward and the karmic test here has been passed, okay? Rather, this is a situation, again, on your person's end or on your end here. The karmic debt has been paid off with showing the world card here. So this card always reminds me of endings and new beginnings as well, all right? So closing out, walking away, leaving a situation here in the past, ending and going into a new beginning here, a new opportunity 
from learning a valuable lesson and experience here, Capricorns. Wow, very interesting. Let's see what else we have here in Tarot Land. The Ten of Wands, that also represents completion. All right, something again or a situation finally now coming to an end. I feel like here, Capricorns, this is more of your energy because you are deciding to put whatever situation or circumstance here that you may feel like was a burden or even overwhelming for you, all right? You may feel like you were the person in the relationship that was doing all the work or having to pick up all the slack or carry the extra weight and burdens from the relationship here on your back. This could also have been from family, loved ones, friends, and even come down to your partner and it became very overwhelming for some of you all. So you decided to put the burdens here down and move forward and look after what is important for Capricorn here as well. Some of you all, this person here could have been a fire sign here, a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries here for others of you all as well here. Wow, very interesting here. Cappies, let's now move a little forward here and use my raw tarot index cards here. Let's get more insight on this person's energy and how they feel and what's to come here for you with the world card here. All right, again, definitely if the reading so far has fulfilled and resonate for you, Cappies, again, don't forget to like, like, subscribe, my loves. Again, we would love to have you here, Capricorn, a part of our soul family here as well. And definitely don't forget to adjust your notification bell again when I go live on this platform. If you would love to book a personal reading with me, Capricorns, my email details is down below to book a personal reading. And we're now going to again use my raw tarot index cards. And if you love the messages that come from my raw index cards here, definitely join my OnlyFans page where I do post daily content, daily uploads there for the zodiac signs that I post here on YouTube. So you get an energy check-in with only using my raw tarot index cards. So that way you can kind of get a feel of the energy before the reading comes out, all right? I do post an energy check-in prior to the day before that reading post on YouTube. So that way you can kind of get an insight on what to expect in that reading, all right? And excuse me for the background noises there, okay? So let's now see. Let's see what this person here wants to say here. Wow, I don't care. I want you, Capricorns, okay? Someone is like, look, I don't care. I want to be with you. I've now been able to close out this chapter or this cycle here. And now I'm looking forward to a new beginning here. Capricorns with you is what some of you are. This person here is wanting to inform you or experiencing at this time. All right, yeah, look at that. All I want is you. All right, so this person is wanting it to be known here, Capricorns, that all they want is you or all they want is to be with someone like you. All right, wow. Let's see what else. Oh, my goodness. Goats, I want to marry you, okay? So this is what it's coming down to here for some of you all. This person is ready to settle down and marry you. I feel like this person now know what they want after experience whatever a situation or circumstance that they experienced with this person here from the past and where they feel like that they were not emotionally fulfilled or happy with this particular person or a connection in their past. Wow, I'm always checking my phone for you, Capricorns. Okay, is so this person what you know? I'm always checking my phone to see if you call, see if you text message me. All right, this person definitely stays by the phone and check out for you. Okay, yeah, look at that. You so fine, Cappies. Mm -mm -mm. This person does a lot of complimenting about you or on you as well here. Wow, I am jealous of you. Very interesting here. So little do you know, you have an energy that is surrounding you that is jealous of you. This could be someone that you are aware of or know here. Or this could be this person's ex or someone that they are aware of and that is known of you. Or this relationship or connection here that you do have always had here. Someone definitely feels some type of way here. Okay, this could also even be an ex of yours, Capricorns. Okay, Wow, we have, I want to come over, Capricorns, okay? This person's like, look, I want to come over. This person may want to discuss and have some type of, I feel like, 
heart to heart conversation with you as well. All right. Wow. Very interesting here, Capricorns. I'm going to leave this portion of the reading here so it doesn't get too scattered out. All right. But however, if you would love again to book a personal reading with me, Capricorns, my email details is down below in the description box. Again, thank you all so much, Capricorns, for your love and support. And thank you so, family, as well. It's always a pleasure. I look forward to assisting each and every one of you all. And definitely love to be ready for Wake and Tarot, Cappies. I love you. You all take care. Bye-bye.